I work on Hearthstone along with these other amazing artists here. We create the trading card art for the game Hearthstone. I'm a digital artist. I've worked on, I think, almost 10 different sets for Hearthstone for about five years now. I've been a Blizzard fan for 15 years. I got my job working for Blizzard just by doing fan art, recreating the characters that I love from the games and submitting art online to contests, like Blizzard sanctioned contests, but pretty much just uploading to the internet for anyone who would look. I've done a couple conventions before, and when I left Denver, it was there was about eight inches of snow on the ground, and it was about eight degrees. So it's pretty nice to come to Anaheim, go visit Disneyland, and just walk around with shorts on. It feels very nice, I'd say. <laughs> The thing I love most about the Blizzard games is kind of the communities that develop and to see that culminate here is amazing and then of course not only as a big fan but also as an artist when I see my art on the stage being presented to all these fans who get so excited it's like an energy exchange unlike any other. I have some exciting art that, uh, that will probably be unveiled here today. It hasn't been publicly released yet but I'm really excited for the new Dragons expansion that we just uh, finished up. And I would say probably my favorite piece of art that I've done is this King Rastakhan painting up here. This is a, a hero skin for the shaman hero in Hearthstone. This is the king of the Zandalari trolls in World of Warcraft. And this was a big honor for me to be able to paint such an important piece for the game. And it's just exciting to be a part of that. My personal inspiration, I would say, comes mostly from Disney or from legendary or contemporary illustrators. I mean, really, as a big fan of Blizzard, it was artists like Wei Wang and Laurel Austin who kind of made me want to be an artist or uh, one of like the creators of the Blizzard style, Samwise Didier, and now to create artwork for the games they work on and meet them here, it's amazing. I'm just happy to be here. I'm happy to be a part of an awesome experience with Blizzard fans and in beautiful Anaheim. I mainly work for Blizzard these days. I just enjoy doing fantasy art. That's mainly what I, I do stuff with, uh, earn my money with. Also concept art a lot for um, gaming companies. Also, I do children books and everything else. So I've always been interested in cultures, fantasy, fairy tales. And so it has been really rooted in my upbringing as well. My parents were always telling me stories and fairy tales. I dream a lot, you know, in my daydreams. So I come up with like some sort of images and then I just put them to paper or to the screen. I'm digital these days. <laughs> this year they just uh, wanted to do the artist nook for the first year and they wanted to invite some of their artists and I was one of them so I was very lucky. I have always played World of Warcraft years and years before I even started drawing for it. So I, I knew the look and the style but I never felt confident enough to actually apply for it, you know. And then it happened, I worked with an agent back in those days and she got me in contact with Ben Thompson and Ben Thompson I knew from a games convention in Germany years and years ago and he actually gave me a job for the first Hearthstone card, is the bear, the, the Robocop. From then on it's, it just kicked off and I got regular work and now here I am. It, it is actually quite uh, a proud moment because I also play Hearthstone. 20 years of being in the business, I'm still like a child when I see something published from me and I was like, okay, this is really cool, yeah. It's a really nice community, very tight-knit as well. So people are coming here and they're saying like, oh, the, the Blink Fox for, for, for example. Um, they, they really love it and they just, just start chatting with you. And it's very nice to have that direct contact with the fans as well. I'm originally from Bavaria, it's in the south, south Germany, around the Munich area. I actually don't want to go home, no. <laughs> I have to go home on Sunday, but 
but uh, yeah, I would like to see a bit more of the area and well, so maybe I will.